so hello hello I'm back once again so in the previous videos or in the previous video whatever I showed you the pixie gap trap base shit and I said that I might just implement it into an actual base and also if you hear like a or something it's my ventilator cause yeah 40 celsius 40 celsius degrees yeah it's nice weather, right? No. So, I said I would implement it into a base. And I said I just might. I wasn't sure if I'm actually going to do that. But here we are. <laughs> Guess what I did? I implemented that into an actual base. Made by somebody famous. Which you might know. It's a 2x2 design, yes. Also, I made some tweaks to the base, cause yeah, I'm retarded. You might know this pattern already, you might not. It's made by H. Chun, if I pronounced the name correct. So, I turned his 2x2 design with wall stacking into a trap base with floor stacking and wall stacking. So basically, if you haven't watched the previous video that I made on the trap base, Basically, you bait people in, and there's a little gap here, which, yeah, I saw on YouTube that you can actually cover those pixie gaps, I mean pixie gaps, those little gaps, a little bit more, so they don't, the autists that you do trap in cannot shoot you, like, straight away, you know what I mean? So, if you don't know what I'm talking about, basically how this trap works, you bait somebody in, they come inside, you close the door. So yeah, they're pretty much dead by now, because they cannot escape. Also, here you will need to place some shotgun traps, you can keep some loot in here. And if you're wondering where the fuck the TC is, if you haven't seen it, <laughs> there it is. It's autistic, I know, but who the fuck would expect in a trap base to have the TC here? Why did I place the TC there, and not for example here? Well, from there you can shoot the TC and they can get your main TC and then you're fucked. But, if you place it here, they cannot shoot it from there, unless they take off this part of the wall, which we will have to upgrade to sheet metal. And on the right you can see there the costs, where they're not that accurate since I haven't put doors on the base, I haven't put leather hatches, I haven't upgraded it to like its final stage here, it's supposed to be sheet metal as well, you know. <clears throat> so yeah, the costs are not accurate, I will show to you the upkeep as well for the main TC, also you have two external TCs, I will show you in a bit, you see. I mean. You're gonna make loot with the trap base, so don't worry about it. This is how it looks from the exterior. So basically, the concept that I thought when I made this shit was basically, you have the trap base. This is the trap that you begin with. You get loot with the trap base, and luckily, if you don't get raided using the trap, you can turn it into a clan base. Also, you can make loot even by then. You just remove those doors. There's supposed to be some doors here, and then you bait people in, thinking that, well, I have been raided or some shit. Also, I put those in, as I said, to make the gaps smaller. Also, it has so many fucking ceilings that it's almost, let's call it, impossible to raid it through the roof. It's just pain. Also here, you can place some loot, you just need to open this garage door, jump on here, you're at the TC, and here you can place boxes. Let me show you. You should be able to put, like, three boxes. I mean, my box placement is always shit, so, yeah. You can place a small one here if you're good enough, but I'm not. So, yeah. This is basically the concept, and if you're asking how do you enter the base and where do you keep the loot, well, here you're supposed to have garage doors, 
which yeah, you will have to close or something because they're gonna think that the interior is the main part here some leather hashes you go up here so here you can go upstairs to the shooting floor All right here you have leather hatch to go on the roof but I didn't put them because I'm too lazy so yeah this one should be upgraded for sure so this should be your main loot rooms and if you're wondering why because you have the pigs down pick downs over here and also you have two entrances like this one here and no sorry and one here so there's two of them all right in case if you get raided and somebody gets you know the trick that you've done well yeah here i didn't put the embrasure i know you can get through here but yeah you have here some shooting here are the TCs, and if you're wondering how the how the fuck do you access them well take a roof put it here or there whatever direction you want doesn't have to be stone can be twig and that's how you access them then it closes when you remove the roof <laughs> all right if you're wondering why the fuck am i making sound like this is because my nose is stuffed for some reason i don't know why so yeah that's basically the concept of the base so let's go to the footprint so this is the footprint basically here in the middle is the trap here is basically the honeycomb those are the honeycombs here is basically those two entrances that i was talking about that was the thesis so i will show you how to build it once again not fully fully because yeah you can twist around the base do whatever you want as per usual put a campfire stand on the campfire go with the foundation i might fuck up the stacking since yeah i never do it perfectly from the first try you know how i do it if you watched the um, previous video so you put those put the doors here put the wall here all right and here you will have to put those put the wall like this facing towards you put a double door here a frame whatever you call it put blue walls uh, half walls sorry here full walls there put ceilings i will show you why and you will need to remove those and you will be ending up with this now you put two foundations here once again half holes okay half holes here you can close this one off if you want and also to build the tc thingy put two half holes there put the triangle take the tc put it here okay to make the trap and the voice crack <laughs> the hell <clears throat> put the um, two ceilings here you already have the gap and based on the stacking the gap can be smaller can be larger you know you see to verify you can verify how large the gap is whatever you want those has to be metal for sure these ones can be metal if you want as well to not make them as visible you know <clears> the <throat> garage door all right so here you can put something like this you know place a ceiling over here for the how do you call it for the little loot room thingy you know if you want it I do want it, I usually do, alright, put some half walls here, half wall here, if you want you can put half wall here as well, you know, I mean this one is quite hard to get, you see, you have to look really down, okay, place them on the low ones, of course, and then, after you're done you basically have the trap 
You see? The trap is pretty much done. You see? Here also you can place loot or whatever. Don't forget to upgrade those to metal. You see? Also, what I was pretty intrigued, let's say, about was that if you try to search the Ace Jun's base design, this one, the 2x2 with the wall stacking, you won't find it for whatever reason. I don't know why, but you won't find it. I don't know, don't ask me why, maybe it was taken down, couldn't find it to others as well. I mean, yeah. I don't know, they know better than I do. You know? So, basically, this is your trap. The trap is absolutely set. To begin the wall stacking, put a square to the entrance. Then triangles here. This is how it's supposed to be looking, okay? Triangles here. I won't use the symmetry because yeah, it's fucked up as per usual. And I'm too lazy to set it up. So, to the entrance, you put here the square and the two triangles. Behind the entrance, don't worry about this one, we're going to fix this one as well. I'm going to show you how. Behind the entrance, put square once again. I mean, you will place three triangles. One square, two triangles. On the other sides, as well, just three triangles. After that, to make the stacking, <coughs> the wall stacking, put one, two, three, four, and the triangle. Four squares and the triangle. Remove the triangle from the middle, the one from there. Go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight triangles in like a half moon type of pattern, you know, till you reach this. You remove the rest of those triangles, leaving this one here. You go one, two, three, four, and then a triangle. And after that, you come back once again with half moons and you place a square. You place two triangles, remove those ones. You see? You can place, I mean, you will have to. So you will have to place a square, triangle, and then square, remove those, and you end up with this. That's the stacking. Square, triangle, square, remove those up. Go to the other side, do the same thing. One, two, three, four, bam, triangle. And once you get used to that, you can do it pretty quick, you know. I'm not that fast, I'm not the base, the best builder, you know. I'm not the best. And I'll probably never be. I don't know. Some say, some say that I cannot build, some say that I do. However, you know. Let me know in the comments if you like the mess that I made here. I call it base, but you can call it mess, you know. So, to make the TCs, the external TCs, you have two options. Either you leave the base exactly as it is, also at the honeycomb here, you know, that's quite mandatory, you know, so you can have some more safety to your little shit shack, you know what I mean, if you're wondering Am I hearing a bird in the background? Yes, if <laughs> you're hearing my parrot, say hello to Pikachu. Yeah, that's how I called him. Long story. So, you go to the entrance. Here you can place like wall if you want. Okay. So here you go to the entrances to the... Uh, how do you call it? To the shooting floor. Yeah, I forgot how to call it. I'm not that, that a very smart person, you know. And yeah, I will never think about myself that I'm smart, because I'm gonna be honest with me till I'm dead. So yeah, also to make the TCs, 
an external DCs, make something like this, you know, where you want your entrances to be. I would like to put them here or there, it depends. I usually put them here, you can place the um, entrances to the shooting floor, however you want, wherever you want, just put them, you know. And also, to make sure that you don't fuck up the singlest simple thing in the world, which is the TCs, because you can actually, like, you know, Oh, authorized building. Ah, attached to an authorized building. How the fuck is that an authorized, an authorized building? <laughs> yeah. That's good, right? Wait, did somebody came on the island or something? No. Yeah. <laughs> Man. So I have to do this from the beginning. The server is nice, right? Think so also. Very center base, yeah, this is pretty much useless to footprint. Yeah. So basically this is just autistic. Fucking shitty as them server. Ah <sighs> Yeah, Rust servers, right? Pretty nice. And now I cannot place this, because it's too close to another building. Somehow. <laughs> Man, this is just fucked up. This one is the one with the stacking, by the way. I missed... Done it, I guess. Does it work now? Finally. So the one with the stacking is this one. You can see also the gap here, you know. So after you put all of the walls, or you can just go on the other sides, you know, for the stacking. Just place triangles here. So if you're wondering why the fuck triangles and not straight up squares, that's because squares, for example, they can just break a square and disconnect your TC, but if you go one, fuck it. One, two, three, four. You see? If they break those, you can place frames like this all over. If you're really insecure about you know, your neighbors. Because you know, you can get some pretty retarded neighbors around you. It depends. If they hate you, they might just try to greet you. Do the same on the other side. You know, as I said, I don't take credit for this because the main thing, you know, the build is inspired from H. June, as I said. So I don't claim this as being mine, you know. Did I make just some tweaks to this and turned it from a trap base to an actual clan base? Pretty much. That's all I've done, it's not my base, you know. It's just a concept, a retarded one that I thought of, that's all. So, after you build this, I will show you how to make the, how do you call it, the pit downs. Once again, I forgot how to call them. I know, I know, totally I'm retarded. And I'm not making this just to make a fool of myself, to be funny, haha, <laughs> no. This is just the way that I am, you know. Then it's not like I can say that's how I usually am, no. <laughs> I'm always like this. And people who know me know that. I'm always like this. You know. And you can place those up, you can put some more if you want. If you're greedy, let's call it, you know. So that's basically the pick downs. Are they done? Yes. Oh, of course, I forgot to... Oh, yeah. Oops. Stability. You see? Those are the pick downs. Don't forget to cover them. Alright. And here, 
I would recommend to put triangles, that's some extra honeycomb. I won't place the triangle ceiling into those, but you will have to. I won't put it because yeah, if I stop to every single little detail, the video will take too long. So yeah, I don't have that much memory also into my computer. Because yeah. Hmm. Told you I'm a brokey. I'm not living like a top G. You know. Also, we are so close to 90 subscribers, which I'm so thankful about. Thank you so much. I really do appreciate it, man. Never dreamt about, you know, couldn't ever imagine that I would get 90 subscribers. Or even close to 90. Hope after this video we can make it to 90. And that's how you make the um, shooting thing, the entrance that I showed you, you know. Pretty standard, pretty simple. Pretty quick to do. If you want, you can make it. If you don't, don't. You know, nobody forces you to make it or something. Do whatever you want. So, that's the entrance, pretty much. That's the most standard of the standard. Here, just place a door, let it open, put some boxes here to bait people in. So, just place garage door, which I did already. Here, you can divide, let's say, you can divide them even more, but placing a door like this, open it, door that opens like this. And that's pretty much it. Nothing extremely complicated, nothing genuinely the best, you know. Hmm. There's better bases around. Uh, for fuck's sake, dude. <laughs> I'm fucking those things up. Like so bad. Those are the... Um, things to go up. For fuck's sake. <laughs> you might encounter those situations too. Depends. You see, I mean, since I have to use the damn ass hammer. Also, here I'm gonna teach you something. Place those first for the stability. Because you will need those. Those are, as mentioned, <laughs> your main loot rooms. Because, yeah, down, I wouldn't trust to, you know, put my main loot down since you can get raided. Plus this is a trap base, so they might just show a raid you, but upgrading it to this might sound like dumb for some people, but for some just might seem crazy. And sometimes in life, crazy is fun, you know. Everybody has their bits of craziness, you know. And the creativity as well. Because if you don't have them, you're just fucking boring. Straight away. For everybody, not just for me, you know. So, just place those on the low ones. Once again. Okay. So, to complete this, place low walls all around this first. I'm gonna show you why. Because otherwise, if you place the... Um, upper ones, you know, first, it will be harder to make this, you know, you know what I mean, make the loot rooms, once again, I mean, you will really need those for stability, even if you're not planning to use them as loot rooms, just please do them, I will show you why, because the roof needs a crap ton of stability, man, a crap ton. So the roof you can do in the multiple ways, you can do something like this for example, if I can actually place it, you know, you can do it like this, you see, it needs stability, you can do it like this for example, 
That's how I like to do it from time to time, you know. So something like this, you see. It makes a pretty interesting pattern, you know. And here, if you cannot place those, just place the ones that you can actually place, you know. And if you cannot place this one, just go ahead and add some frames here or something. It should have stability. 14, indeed I missed something then. Might have missed something. I mean, you can add more of those if you don't have enough stability, you know. You should be able to add some here, here and there, you know. You should have the stability right now. Oh, shit. Doesn't want to work. Did fuck something up, I think. As per usual. You can place something like this. On the other way around, of course. If you want. You can help yourself with those. If they actually do want to work. You know. You can put some retarded shit like this. So yeah, I did fuck up something. I don't know what. There is some stability issue somewhere here. Let's place some more of those then. I think I missed a wall somewhere or something. So yeah, sorry for that. You see, I missed the frames there. So after that you can just put this ones here. And there is your... How do you call it? Roof and not roof entrance, roof access. Put whatever the fuck you want, single door, garage door, double door, <laughs> whatever man. Put whatever. And I will show you how to do the fix. Only on one side because yeah, otherwise the video will take too long. And yeah, you just place door here, door here, door here, door here. And window, you know, and that's it. Put door here, door here, open it, door here and open it, door here and open it. And to seal this one off, you will see that you don't have stability, don't worry about it, just put frames. You know, put some more here, and then you can place the ceilings and that's pretty much it if you want you can just make the shooting floor and leave it as it is that's basically the base and how it works simple they come around here you know you can make the entrance to the thing you know here so they go straight into this i made it like this you know it depends on your preferences also to close this door you can just boom this one you know on that one or you can place it to face this one so the garage door is gonna be something like that if you can place it from the interior you see so you can close it from this one you just press on this one boom done you know if you want to get up here you know just close just open this one and here you can place the boxes you can place a ramp if you want you know whatever you want to do place the boxes you know you can keep some loot in here as i mentioned i didn't made the base as it's supposed to be entire thing it's supposed to be at least sheet metal you know i mean it's quite bit of expensive thing to do i know but bro it's a treble base and the clan base into the same base what else do you want for real 
If you don't like it, just leave a dislike to the video, don't mind, you know. Also appreciate the support from lately, thank you so much. So yeah, what else can I say? I showed you pretty much the base, the let's call it concept, and here you cannot place those since of the stacking, you know, because I made the roof some sort of a like tube, I don't know, darts things, darts arrows facing each other. So yeah, this is why you cannot put those, but you can put things here, you know, and here you can make the roof if you want full access to the roof just place some things like that you know then you'll need stability a crap ton of it just place those you know continue the shooting floor and make the base add some like tweaks to it and if you have any feedback to the base and what is supposed to be added or if you have any other ideas, please let me know. You know. We can't add things here. The roof is quite fucked up to explain it, because I don't remember how Asian made it. You know. Because you cannot find any videos, as I said. I mean, I couldn't. Maybe you can, but I couldn't. I couldn't find any videos at all on that thing you know i tried recently because i remembered about the base and how nice it is you know i always liked this i used it quite a lot when i played on 10 times five times you know the usual <clears throat> so yeah thank you so much for watching this i hope you liked the a little concept let's call it and if you don't well <laughs> lucky my friend never lucky you know let me know your opinion into the comments let me know that i cannot build yeah we'll still be making stuff like this till i get bored absolutely bored of it or till they remove floor stacking and wall stacking also i'm working on some weird shit and if you made it to the end of the video i'm gonna show you a secret so you can make this i'm gonna show you you see and you will snap here put the foundation here for example you can make this as a pc i will show you something interesting you know and you can make this then like you know and it's half a thing to close to another building i fucked up the um, stacking just a second fucked up the thingy wait let me just try again it was too close to the um, square i'm assuming to the triangle sorry I don't know, the geometrical shapes or whatever you call them. I'm retarded, I just told you. You know. You see, but it takes some tries. I will try till I get it right. So I can show it to you. What I'm working on. What I'm working on, yes. <laughs> the usual voice cracks. You see, I got it. Finally. Also, if you have some more inspiration than I do, which I know that you do, I'll like your feedback and also ideas. So, basically, you know, that's the concept. I would like to make a partnership, let's call it, with you people to make this base come true. So, basically, let's turn this shit into a clan base. I don't know any stacking 
what you can actually make for this because <clears throat> if you remove those you know if you remove those you might end up with something like this which is absolutely fucked up and hilarious you know and if you remove those yeah the walls are totally gone and this is not good you know what i mean if you have any inspiration or any ideas please let them know let me know in the comments i would really love to create this base as some sort of a community project you know what i mean if you want let me know in the comments i can even give you my discord so we can talk you know don't just don't be a troll don't waste time you know don't waste your time don't waste mine you know so yeah that's just like a sneak peek for perhaps the future videos i don't know i can't promise on this it has potential it's interesting you know because it's half of a foundation that's why i like it you know i mean you see you can build extremely random picks i think but not with this because yeah, it's just fucked up you know you know what i mean i don't know but i think you can do nice things with it if you actually got the inspiration you know which i do not for the time being I have no idea what to do with those, even though I like it, you know, might gonna do something with it, I don't know, I don't promise anything, so yeah, to not make this video, video and <laughs> sorry, to not make this video any longer, I will stop here, thank you for watching, appreciate it, you know. I would like to know your feedback in the comments about this one as well, and for sure about this, the main subject of today's dumbass video. <laughs> so yeah, thank you so much for watching, take care of yourself, stay hydrated, buy yourself a ventilator so you can hear wind 24-7, so yeah, just kidding, have a good one, and stay safe, bye bye.